x2 minus x1 which is the two point form next we talk about perpendicular form if the constants are perpendicular OM from origin to the line AB ON equal to P and angle NOX is equal to alpha if PXY be any point on the line draw PL perpendicular to OX LR perpendicular to ON also PM perpendicular to RL then clearly angle PLR equals alpha OL is equal to X therefore OR upon OL is equal to cos alpha that is OR is equal to OL cos alpha which is equal to X cos alpha also PL is equal to Y implies PM upon PL is equal to sin alpha that is PM is equal to PL sin alpha which shows Y sin alpha hence OR plus RN is equal to OL OR we have found out is equal to X cos alpha PM is equal to RN therefore RN is equal to Y sin alpha hence OR plus PM equal to P that is X cos alpha plus Y sin alpha is equal to P which is the equation in normal form or perpendicular form sixth is parametric form here A x1 y1 is a point on the line which makes an angle theta with positive direction of x axis let P x y be any point on the line where A P is equal to R that is the distance draw AL perpendicular to OX PM perpendicular to OX and AQ perpendicular to PM in triangle PAQ sin theta is equal to PQ upon AP that is PM minus QM upon R that is Y minus Y1 upon R therefore y minus y1 is equal to r sin theta or y minus y1 upon sin theta is equal to r also cos theta is equal to aq upon ap which is equal to lm upon r lm can be written as om minus ol upon r that is x minus x1 upon r therefore x minus x1 is equal to r cos theta or x minus x1 upon cos theta is equal to r combining the two we get x minus x1 upon cos theta is equal to y minus y1 upon sin theta is equal to r which is the equation in parametric form it can alternately be written as x is equal to x1 plus r cos theta and y is equal to y1 plus r sin theta which is called parametric form or distance form.